Chief Emeritus Bill Stephan is here to tell us about that snowy weekend forecast that we got for yeah. West Michigan. Boy, I tell you what, we got snow falling out there right now and uh, briefly heavy at times. It's starting to accumulate on some of the grassy areas out there. Take a look at East Grand Rapids and look at the football field. All white out there, ready for somebody to go and make a snowman, I guess. Uh, temperature is cold enough for the snow to stick to the grassy areas, though they are still a, a degree or two above the freezing mark. Uh, if you look in the distance there, you can see across the lake for a while. You couldn't do that. It was snowing so hard. Uh, the light that's just to the right of the flagpole, we often use that to judge uh, how hard the snow is falling there. Most main roads uh, are just wet at the current time, and that'll continue to be the case here overnight tonight. Storm track live, we see some blue and some green, so there is a little bit of rain mixing in yet, but there'll be more snow than rain overnight tonight, though most of it should be on the light side. The snow has moved into the Kalamazoo area. They kind of avoided the snow here until uh, around 6.30 or so, and then it moved in from the west. There'll be additional snow showers there overnight. Overnight tonight, and you can see the heavier snow in the darker blue colors here from Allegan County up toward the Grand Rapids area here. Uh, that will continue on and off here right on through the night. Temperatures, as I mentioned, pretty much at or above the freezing mark. We're still 32 up around the Big Rapids area. We got 33 Sturgis and Coldwater and in Grand Rapids as well. A couple degrees warmer at the lake shore, and that will continue to be the case overnight tonight. Lake water temperature, by the way, is around 53. Heading out this evening, 35 degrees our temperature by 10 o'clock. Southwest winds at 10 to 15 miles an hour. Wind chills only in the 20s.